Hi, I'm John Gleason, and this is UDOT's Weekly Construction Update. We've got projects all across the state, and here are a few to keep in mind this weekend. In Taylorsville, plan for lane restrictions on southbound Bangor Highway near 5400 South. Southbound Bangor is reduced to one lane each night and two lanes each day through the end of October. All lanes will be open each weekday for the evening commute. In addition, the southbound leg of the continuous flow intersection at 5400 South is closed. Southbound drivers are using the center turn lane as you would at a standard intersection. Workers are relocating the Jordan Valley Aqueduct to prepare for construction of a new freeway style interchange starting next spring. On the I-215 East Belt, construction has begun on a new barrier replacement project between I-80 and 6200 South. Most work will take place in the shoulder, but there will be occasional lane restrictions during non-commute hours. This project will continue through the fall. And in St. George, work continues on a project to widen I-15 between St. George Boulevard and Green Springs Drive. Right now, traffic has been shifted to the northbound lanes and crews just started setting the beams for the new southbound bridge. All lanes on I-15 are open during the daytime hours, but the freeway is reduced to one lane in each direction at night. This project is adding exit-only lanes to a two-mile stretch of I-15 and building a new crossing under the freeway to improve traffic flow in the area. For information on these and all other UDOT construction projects, please visit our website, udottraffic.utah.gov, or you can download our free UDOT traffic app.